Good morning again. Welcome to Hangori Channel again. I'm your host, and today we're going to show you the first exhibitions at the beginning of the year for the label industry, which is the Sino Label Show 2024 in Guangzhou. We are showing a collaboration of exhibitions between Hangori Label Source and Hang Label with the hybrid machine. Let's go. So the first highlight from our show is the Left Star 330 S7 color. With this machine, we have white plus CNYK OV with 600 dpi, which will be able to print on where you find text. We are showing real production at 35 meters per minute. You can see that we will be able to print extremely fine vernets and color QR code. Have a look at the quality of this. So let's bring you to another two machines. So the second highlight for the show is the 330S hybrid. Now with this is a best hybrid configuration so far. First, we have the one unit, which you have the candle lever system moving there for the material to go up and down. And then secondly, you will have the option of uh, having the black two unit at the front before the engine. Now with this, you'll be able to print with thicker material, sometimes you need priming. So you'll be able to use this for priming purposes, or you'll be able to use it as a whole for traditional whole folding unit on top of here. And then after that, it will go into our machine. Now at the moment, the machine is configured to white plus CMYK, and we have extra two uh, inject stations. Now with those two inject stations, we are using it as a digital foiling um, inject. So with the last two print heads, we are going to print on UV adhesives. And after that, you will have foiling lamination unit on here. Um, the specialty what we want to show on this machine is also you'll be able to use a narrow uh, um, foiling on the print so you'll be able to save a bit of the foil when you are printing and after that you'll be having a, a traditional vinyl unit to finish off with the rewind of the product so this is uh, the second highlight what we have on the show I will show you the major highlights over there now the press be beside me is the major highlight for Sino Label 2024, which is our more complicated hybrid digital printing machine. So as you can see, we'll have the same unwind system at the front. And after that, we'll have the flexor unit here. And what we've done with the show is a white for CMYK. And with the extra two units, we are still printing on digital folding. So after you um, finish with the printing, uh, with the inkjet printing, it will go to our digital folding procedure over here. And we have another special function on this unit as well. This is a self-developed um, double-sided flexible printing station. So you'll be able to print the front end with um, surface coating with varnish, or you'll be able to rewrap itself and then print the back side as well. What this can be used for adhesive printing purpose as well. And after that, as you know, with the varnish unit, you need to have a long web path before curing. So we also extend the web, and this unit over here, you'll be also using it turn bar. The cooling unit is down the top over here. So you extend the web part with a better intro on one chip. After that, we have a semi-rotary die cutting unit. And then after we die cut the material, of course, we will have our scrape matrix removal system. After that, you will also have the cooling table with the rewind at the back. And let's take a look at the samples over here. Beautiful label look with digital foiling applications. Of course, you'll be able to add on more units to make the machine a little bit more complicated to shoot 
the needs of your own application. So ladies and gentlemen, this concludes our highlights for the Sino Label 2024. The major show will be at Drupa 2024, which is at the end of May and early June. Now the next highlight for Hang Global Label Business will also be Label Expo 2024 in Chicago in September. If you like more updates on our channel, please subscribe to our Hang Glory channel. And if you like this particular video and think this video is helpful for you, please give a thumbs up and we'll see you again next time. Thank you.